Hello, 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 and welcome to the game Once Human. So now I would thought I'd do a YouTube tutorial because uh, I have 22 pumps um, in my acid farm. So this is a massive acid farm that I've got operating. So um, I'm going to show you how you get all these pumps, how you get them all working, and what you need and what you don't need. Obviously, you need pretty much everything I'm going to show you, but eh, you never know. So. I say I got 22 pumps here, right? 22 pumps. So I have a load of generators. I got seven. The max you can get is six, but um, that guy over there was able to make me an extra one, which is uh, very, very kind of him. And also, I have the deviant uh, power generator buff of 15%. So that's why. They have, um, that's why I have so many water pumps and also all the other stuff down here. But also, I got deviant um, electric eels. I have uh, loads of them. I shall uh, show you down here. So I got one there. One, two, three, four, five, six. I got seven of them. So one each generator. I do need to get a couple more um, to, uh, you know, just in case one of these run out of power and then I need to, another one replaces it. So, so wh what I did, right, so, you place these down, right, simple, you put these together, and then you need these compact water filters, which uh, gets dirty water. Now, the problem with being in a polluted zone, so this is a big polluted zone, you can't have water catchers, because water catchers does not, uh, does not allow you to, uh, well, it doesn't let you get water because it doesn't rain, basically. So you have to do that yourself. But luckily, I live next to a river. So that's easy peasy. Just go over there. 15 every, like, what, like half a second. So it's pretty easy. Then you put it in these tanks. So water tanks, as you can see. And then you connect these through a pipe. So press B. And uh, then you press V, pipe, and then V again. You don't need power for these, obviously. And, then that, and also make sure there's gravity. So gravity is a bigger... Uh, is a big and um, important uh, necessity in this game. So it has to be above for it to go down the pipes into the water cap, um, water filters, which uh, which then I put into these water tanks. I know it looks very confusing. Trust me, it took me forever. So these are the water tanks. I do have uh, a three of them. Yeah, one, two, and three. Which then these will then go into the Osmosis water purifiers, which. Uh, no, I, I lied. It will not go into them. Um, so then the water from the ba um, for these will go straight into these ferment ferments. So this is where you'll be making your acid, uh, uh, your acid farm, um, basically in, in these uh, brewing uh, barrels, which these need electricity as well, which is 10 per. And these are 10 per as well, these four things. I do have two, four, I have six ferments going. So that's good, and also our four water purifiers. So our water pumps. So all these take ten electricity each, and there you go. That's uh, you know they're all running. So at least oh oh uh oh, that's not good. Right, uh. so this is why I need more electric eels. Yep, because uh, uh, because uh, I need more electric eels, I can't run. Every single one of them at the same time. See if you see here, there's two of them out. Right. No, there's three of them. So three deviants are um, resting right now. S but when they're all active, you can have all of these running. All 22 of them. And uh, and then the post. Oh, God. I see my, my base is a bit of a mess. So, uh, oh, let's jump up here. All right. So that's, that's that's pretty simple to be honest. Right, let's show you where you find everything, shall we? So press uh, press O to go into your Cryptfist, whatever it's called. Go in here, and all right, take me a second. No, nope, no, nope, it's not there, is it? Uh, right, so there's the electric kits. So get to the bottom one. Bottom one is the deviant uh, generator. No, nope. where's the deviant generator? There it is. Sorry, deviant generator. And then you need the water pumps which is here, the rain catcher, don't need that, but if you're in a zone that's not uh, uh, that's not polluted, it will be quite easy. So you can easily just go to uh, put them up and that will get you uh, water and you connect the pump 
and then you put a pipe into the uh, water purifier which will make it into clean water straight into the into the barrel thingy bobber and then there's a uh, water storage so that's you know you need one of those water tank and uh, filters I could just use them in the comp I could uh, technically make the water out of the uh, out of these ones here but uh, I think one takes more energy than the other like technically I could um, I could turn these into these up here instead because these take uh, six energy they take uh, they take 10 but these have four slots in you see so the so if you have all four filled up they will do one each so you'll get four every I think it's every couple of uh, every couple of minutes yeah every couple of minutes you get a you get one and then the only problem is though you've got to access it you have to take them out so you're in your inventory and then you do have to go in here and you do it stacks of 10 and there you go and as I say I got two so I'm making two per 20 minutes so these take 20 minutes per acid so 20 minutes 20 minutes okay if that if that makes perfect sense um, but it, it's all pretty simple when you get used to it it took me a while to actually uh, implement it properly and how to do it and the gravity part I was uh, a bit annoyed at because I was just a uh, I put them all on one level and yeah it just was not working so you're going to make sure that these are up in the air as high as you can to go into these barrels like I've only got a I've only got two roofs here with all the barrels in you see they're all full of water these won't be full but they do have say, three and then it went down to two, uh, down to one because they've gone into these which then they will turn into lovely impure acid and it looks like I'm about to have a third uh, um, a third a lot going as well because uh, with these you see you can only put 100 per so you can't like split them which is a, a little bit annoying but it is what it is um, if, 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 if you like my base my base is pretty simple it's a uh, pretty basic I'm not really a base builder so um, honestly it's it's pretty easy I've sh kind of shown you how to do it to be honest it's you just have to get the dirty water from over there and then put them into these uh, into these uh, uh, into these barrels here. No, oh, I'm looking at the wrong barrels now, aren't I? Um, yeah, these barrels up here, and they will automatically go into these purifiers. Oh, that's a water pump. Okay, that's the water pump. So, uh, go in here, dirty water, straight to purified water. Then that w purified water will then go into the water tank, and then all the way down into these uh, brewing and um, brewing thingy bobbers. So. Uh, it is pretty easy. This getting all the power, you're going to definitely need teammates to help you or have the deviant uh, specialization. So let's go to metrics and this one up here. And then I have this one here. Is that the one? Oh, that one. No, that's the, that. You can get some for solar panels and that. I need to, when I get another reset, I can, uh, I can change that. But here's the deviant power. So this will give an extra 15%. And also. Oh, it gives you an extra... Oh, no, 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 I think that's just that one there. Okay, that's just there, because that gives you an extra power generator as well. So uh, you get six altogether as a per on your personal self, and then, uh, like, my teammate over there had a specialization perk that could get an extra generator. He came over, and he gave me one. Also, my teammate over there got one as well. He's got a bit of a farm going. But uh, mine's more... Mine's bigger. Mine's the biggest one. So out of all this, doing all of this here... I make about 1,600 per day of acid. Right, um, I have used some up now, but uh, basically today, there, we are, 1,500. I still got that amount left. So uh, I have been making some ammo because I do use the tungsten ammo. Um, so yeah, that's, that's pretty much how it works. It's pretty simple. It's going to build. Um, right click, left click, sorry, facilities, storage. Here it is and processes there it is the water pump and then the power power is over here for the deviants he's got the little symbol i can't yeah the little uh, power symbol that means it's a uh, extra 15 percent and also these ones have it as well but uh, i don't use these so technically so these have 30 watts so it gives me an extra 15 percent which i think it goes up to about 39 watts and then you had these deviants over here but it also depends 
Um, oh, let's have a go down here. So it also depends how good the deviant is. So this one is a, 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 status, um, a skill rating of 2, activity rating of 3, which is really good because give, that gives you more energy. And then it also has uh, a deviant trait, which uh, gives me 15% more mood. So the more mood, the better. I'm not sure if... if uh, there is. I've got an activity rating of 4, which is absolutely fantastic. Um, no deviant traits, uh, but uh, skill 2. So how do you get these deviants? Well, what you do, you go to the map. All oh, my teammates are here. Our hive. So you go down to here. Uh, Mercy's Market. And you have a dock just down here. And you need a fishing rod. And there's also a woman down there, which you can buy the bait from. Um, it's like 50 energy credits per bait, which isn't too bad at all. Really easy to get energy credits if you have gold and silver ore. So, uh, I see I got, uh, I got quite a lot, so I'm good. Um, so that's pretty much how it works. So if you guys have any questions at all, please throw them my way. Um, please like and please subscribe. Be much appreciated. And also, if you want to see any other videos, any, uh, any videos on whatever you want to, uh, know about, just let me know and I will make the video for you. And if anyone's not actually heard of this game, which I'll be quite surprised on, this game is free on Steam. Just look up Once Human and download it and uh, have a play. Um, also, if you'd like to check out my description uh, in the uh, in the video, the video description, and I'm Patreon and everything's in there. So if you if you know if you want to support the channel, I'll be much appreciated, and uh, I love you forever. Um, so I will uh, I will leave this one here. So that's how it works. Um, any questions, just leave a comment. And thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!